Yo, 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 what's up, my G's? What's going on? Hope everybody's had a good week so far, guys. Work, school, shit. If you just sit there and jerk it all day, hey, own it, brother. We all wish we could be you. Happy Friday and welcome back, guys. Yo, if you're new, my name's Caveman and you want to hit that subscribe button, bro, because we're doing money glitches up the ass on this channel, man. Listen, speaking of which, I got a badass little money glitch, bro, for the weekend, okay? It's easy, okay? Real easy, all right? You need a friend, guys. It's not solo, but it's easy as shit, okay? So, as the friend, the helper, let me start off by saying you don't need shit, okay? Nothing at all. The duper, though, the duper, you obviously right here is what you need. The friend, obviously. You need an Avenger and a facility, okay? You both want to throw yourself in a friends-only session. It'll be a lot easier that way, and you'll see why later, okay? You want to fill the facility up with RH8s or back yields, and you want your retro that you're duping to be inside of the facility. You need an MOC because that's how you're saving these fucking things, okay? This is all for the duper. The helper, like I said, bro, you need nothing, okay? And this is how you want to start it off. You want to start off by going ahead and uh, either pulling out a Faggio or RHA from your uh, facility or call one from a garage, okay? Leave it outside and jump on in to your Avenger, okay? Now, as soon as you get in, you hit right D-pad to get the uh, customization option and then hover over exit facility. Now, this has to be fast, guys. When you're hovering over there, you, you hold down the start button and as you let it go, immediately hit A or X on PS4 and you're gonna get glitched out like this in this little screen right here, okay? Now your friend can get into the passenger side of the Avenger. The moment your friend gets in, it's gonna be on a black screen, okay? Now, what you have to do is you have to go and join a friend, any friend, and it cannot be in a different targeting mode, okay? It has to be a friend that you can join all the way through because you have to be able to join their session all the way through, guys, okay? So it's not like we always do where we, we you know, accept the first one and deny the second one. No, you have to join all the way through just like this. And then when you get to the other friend's session, whoever the hell that might be, just join back on your friend. And this is why I told you to, to do the friend-only session because it's a lot easier to join back. So you can either join back from your dashboard just like this or you can hit your start menu and join them um, just like this, okay? I mean, e either or. It doesn't, it doesn't really matter. You just want to go ahead and join your friend back because your poor friend's stuck on that black screen this whole fucking time, okay? So just go ahead and accept these alerts. And you're going to go ahead and uh, and get him out of that black screen, okay? Now, once you spawn back in, you see he's stuck in there. And he can't move. And his screen is black. The way you get him out is you have to go to Jobs, Rockstar Created, and start one of these missions, okay? Just go ahead and start uh, tightening up a job, okay? That's perfect. Now, you want to start this thing all the way through, okay? And when you make sure that it's all the way loaded up, now you send your friend an invite, and he's going to accept it and wait on the black screen alert, okay? Now, when he's waiting on the black screen alert, he tells you that he's there. Now, you can back out of the job, okay, and he can accept the uh, the invite fully, okay? But he can't accept it until you back out of the job first, okay? Because if not, it's going to mess up the glitch, guys, just so you know. So, right there, that's what we did right there. And uh, you see how he accepts it, and then he gets an unavailable to connect, which is why he disappears right here. And then when he accepts that, he's going to reappear. Watch. Boom done deal you see this is the only hard part bro once you get this shit down right here you're good to go you only have to do this shit once and other facilities glitched out okay and you both run right over to your uh to your retro okay and you want to get in now this is a little tricky so i'm going to show you guys how this works you get in and the car is fully on and when your friend gets in see how he doesn't pass over because you have to get out of the car the moment that your friend grabs onto the so you go ahead and uh, press to get the hell out of the car, okay? So it has to be just like this and your friend now can pass over to the driver's side And you just jump on in the car because now your friend's able to drive your your vehicles around in your facility You know what I'm saying? That's how you glitch this part out But you have to give him access because if not he can't do this, okay? And that's the only way to give him access to this Now you drive on down there and you wedge this thing like we've been doing forever, okay? You guys know what's up. You just got to wedge it in order to be able to teleport in and out of the thing um, in and out of the car, okay? So, so just check it a couple of times just to make sure you are teleporting because if not, the shit won't work. Now, when your friend gets out of the car, they'll teleport out and you have to make sure that your character actually passes over to the driver's side. If, you're pa if, if your character does not pass over to the driver's side, like you see right here, then you're not going to get the car when you, when you leave, okay? Make sure that he passes over to the driver's side and you're, and you're teleporting in and out of the driver's seat, okay? Now, you go over here and you're going to press A 
and uh, and why at the same time, okay? At the same time, so that you exit and get in the car at the same time. Now, when you exit the facility, you're gonna come out with your vehicle, and this, uh, oh, I forgot to mention, guys, you don't need custom plates for this shit, because that's why you're leaving the car out there, okay? You're, you're taking the plates from whatever car you leave outside. So, clean plates on this, all right? Now, once you get out, you just wanna go ahead and call up your MOC, drive up to it, and put it in the back. Accept this alert, put it in the back, okay? This is real simple at this point. Once you put it in the back, dude, just to be safe, bro, pull that some bitch out, okay? And uh, and pull it right back in just to get that saved, okay? You want to make sure that the shit the, the shit's in there and it stays in there, right? You know, you don't want to do this shit for no reason. So go ahead and just pull it out right back in. And now you can go ahead and come out on foot. And this, this is the beautiful part of it all, dude. Jump in your MOC and bring it right next to your facility, bro, because... Once you're glitched out, as long as your friend does not leave the uh, facility, the MOC will not despawn, okay? So it'll stay right there, bro. That is awesome. You don't have to keep going back and forth. So now you just go ahead and park this bitch right here. Go back in, okay? Remember, you got to pull the car out. Now, look at this tag just so you guys know what's up. Uh, now I'm going to show you the custom plate deal, okay? So go ahead, always remember to pull that car out. You have to leave a car outside or the glitch won't work. Now remember that, five, seven, three, okay? Now go jump in. And we're gonna go ahead and do this glitch again for you guys real quick. So you can see how quick this fucking, this rinse and repeat is. Now look, I left this in so you guys can see. When you come down, if your friend's right next to you like this, that's what you want, okay? Because your friend's nowhere near you, obviously. You see that shit. My friend's over there waiting to get the next dupe out of here, okay? But you see that little glitch screen like that? That's what you want, bro. Then you know you can come in and out of this thing as many times as you want, and you're good to go. Oop, there's my dupe. Oh, shit. Okay, so check it. Now we're going to do the same thing we did before, okay? Remember what I told you. You got to get in and let this thing start up fully, okay? Once you have the engine fully on, then your friend can jump in. The moment he grabs that, you get the hell out. The moment he grabs the handle, bro, get the hell out of the car. You know what I'm saying? You'll get that. I mean, it'll only take you maybe one or two tries, but you'll get that, dude. That's just not that that hard. It's, it's harder to glitch out the Avenger, to be honest with you. Um, so then just drive down here, bro. That's it. Where's this some bitch again? And do what we did before. You're gonna go ahead and teleport, guys. And remember, that's really important because a lot of people don't don't understand why the hell they come outside and they come outside on foot. You know, oh, where the hell's my car type shit? All right, well your car is not there because you're not teleporting in and out of the driver's side, bro. So that. The fact that you teleport in and out of the driver's side means that you have access to the vehicle fully, okay? So, you want to go ahead and have full access and hit A and uh, and Y again. Boom. Get that some bitch out of there. Now, I'm going to show you right here what I mean with the custom plates, okay? I'm going to show you this custom plate. So, you see that it took the custom plate from the uh, RH8 that we left out here, the free RH8, okay? Boom. 573, bitches. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Clean plates. And look at this shit. You don't even have to drive far, dude. Fucking put it in there, accept this, and you're good to go because the uh, the retro you left in there, um, you know what I'm saying? Like, it went back. You know, you saw the dupe over there, okay? Well, you're good to go. Remember, always pull this on bitch out just to be safe. Pull it out. Pull it right back in just to get that game safe. And, and that's all, that's literally the only reason why you do this. But it's, it's more of a peace of mind, bro. You don't want to do all this shit. Let's say you dupe 20 cards. You come back next time you load up your game. Boom. Where the fuck are my 20 cards? Exactly, bro, because you didn't save them. You know what I'm saying? Take the time to do this. Just come in and out of the fucking thing and uh, and then uh, come out on foot, okay? Now, if you have uh, the ability to register as a motorcycle president, dude, it'll be way faster, even faster, even better. You just call him up from any other fucking garage. You call up a free faggio. Or, or not a free faggio, sorry. They cost like five grand, dude, but come on. If you do this a couple of times, money ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead and get on it for a little bit just so it registers you. And then you can jump in there. You see what I'm saying? Like, if you don't have the motorcycle present, then you're going to have to call. You're going to have to call a mechanic or you're going to have to go in and out and take another car out, which you have to deal with this bullshit screen and, and this this scene right here, that which I fucking hate, bro. You know what I'm saying? So if you have a motorcycle president, you can go ahead and call the Faggios up. Boom. They stay right there. You're good to go, bro. Jump on in and rinse and repeat. Just glitch the shit out of this, bro. I'm telling you, this glitch is awesome. It's easy easy okay you only have to do that bullshit in the avenger one time then you can come in and out in and out in and out just like this and dupe the shit out of these cars i mean i'm talking dude what did it take me i mean maybe a minute you know what i'm saying maybe a minute dude per dupe you know what i'm saying so get after it dudes i hope you like this glitch 
Hope you guys get after it, and I hope you liked the video. And if you did, please smash the like button, man. It helps your boy out, okay? Hit the subscribe button because you don't want to miss the next one. We're doing a shitload of these, okay? So trust me, hit that subscribe button with the notification bell, all right? And comment. If you're having issues with the glitch, comment, bro. Trust me that I will get back to you, and I'll help you with this shit, okay? So comment on the video. All right, dudes. Hope you guys liked it. It's your boy, Caveman. I'm out. Peace.